Hello beautiful people, welcome back to our channel. Today we are back with another video and this time it is Surabaya after a long time. And uh, the title of this video is Surabaya Indonesia, my first impressions. So let's see Surabaya again after a long time. Probably we have, last time we reacted on Surabaya maybe probably two years ago. Yeah, I, don't I think so, two years ago. Finally we are back with Surabayans. Surabayans, hello, we are watching your... Uh, your city, yeah. Okay, so let's get started. Surabaya Hadir. There is also in famous uh, zoo over here, and people coming to having uh, pictures. Uh, and this is the monument. I just want to say. Yeah. People, you know, people are taking pictures there. And this is like uh, basically the crocodile and this uh, famous the famous monument. And the people making uh, and making the pictures. And there's the shot a little bit more. Oh, so the shark and okay. uh, crocodiles. Okay, I got to get to the back because it's very hard. Famous hotel Majapahit here in Surabaya city. This is an active hotel, you can stay here. It's very nice architecture. And yeah, this is the one of the most and uh, biggest attraction here in Surabaya, Hotel Majapahit, because it's very old and very rich into the history. Also, you can get inside, you can stay. So, yo, what's up? I, 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 Okay, school boys. School. Okay. Oh, Look at that. What was that? Okay. Nice place. I have to say little bit, little bit like a raffles. Hey, that kind of sign. Probably like the finger. Uh, I don't, maybe, sure maybe. Maybe. Places, I think but, so. Uh, I like to compare the price to that hotel. What could be the? No, I was reading about the streets and the city skyline. Okay. Now we know. 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 We Probably 100 out of, uh, 95 out of 100 people would have, uh, you know, ignored it, but he mentioned it. Look at that. So here we go. This is the Grand Palace here in Surabaya. Also looks pretty decent, actually. Monaterio looks like this one. Also over here is something very interesting looking, like this one, okay. Yeah, I can see. celebrate the independence date of Indonesia today. Okay, you can see. Very happy. And that's the monument of Sukarno and Hatta. Oops. <laughs> hello, hello. And yeah, this is it. Happy, happy Surabaya people. And that's the monument over here. Overall, uh, I'm walking here around a little bit. And Surabaya looks pretty clean, I gotta tell you. Everything is organized here. That's my impression. So that's a nice looking park uh, in general. Some I think he's from Iran. The way he's speaking, the monument he sounds like Iranian. And a little bit of Maybe I'm wrong, but that is... I guess. To be honest, we don't know who is he. This is the very first time we, we are reacting to his video. We don't know his background. That is the same as the guy we are calling in the panel. So it looks actually very interesting. Also, interesting facts about the Surabaya is that this is the second biggest city in Indonesia. Yeah, after Jakarta. And in their times, that they have the biggest harbor, the biggest port in Southeast Asia region. Also the biggest uh, Indonesian and Chinese community living in Surabaya. Also the two the biggest malls in Indonesia are in Surabaya, but that's later on to this video. Now let's focus on more uh, what the city has to offer. Actually, I should get out and uh, down. This is the Cantor Gubernur, so Gubernur of Surabaya House, uh, with the old architecture. And there is some uh, war memorial sign, but uh, the gates are closed, so cannot. And there's also museum, Monument Chugu Pahlavan, as you see, that's the name. Uh, similar thing to Jakarta one. And the museum is there, but I'm not into museums. Museum. So I wanted to show you a little museum. bit. Uh, this is the, all the information. They also have a, a navy station right now in the harbor uh, in Surabaya and the old submarine, which is attraction. However, I'm not going. I have a very limited time to show you Surabaya today. <laughs>
first building spark red night like yeah. every other regular mall that's the that's the size is regarding the plaza the whole entire concept but yeah we are looking for coffee maybe down maybe up let's see and this is the grand atrium for the mall uh so uh you know they have some exhibition center as always looks pretty big but of course the sizing of the malls is categorized due to the plazas so there's also a lot of hotels like westin and over four points by Sheraton and other other stuff not only the mall itself but the whole entire plaza Seventh is ground floor. Sightseeing 
people mm. see tourist attraction or something in Surabaya. Surabaya, definitely, this is not a tourist city like Jakarta, for example, would have a much more to offer regarding like a it's temple or going to the mm-hmm. uh, cave or something like that. In Surabaya, Surabaya is more in business oriented. Probably, this is a great place. Oh, so yeah. That is true. Making a business also thanks to the Chinese community here. Uh, that's why also you can see a little bit different vibe in Surabaya, less traffic, city is pretty organized, clean, nice, uh, but uh, not much to do here. However, if you are looking to go for malls, uh, you can find some best in Indonesia, which other smaller cities don't have it. Also the brands, like, I don't know, you want to have a Chanel or, or, or Rolex or something you can find here or in Jakarta, obviously, but that's mostly in two these cities. And also, yeah, you can find some nice restaurants as well. Um, I thought that's pretty, um, that's it, what I'm gonna tell you. Mm-hmm. Anyways, tomorrow I'm going back to Bali, so don't you worry, the Bali videos coming back. And, and yeah, what else I would like to add about Surabaya? Happy as I visited the city, that's for sure, because i never been in Surabaya. Uh, so now if somebody asks you, Daniel, have you been in Surabaya? I've been, so... So, yeah. His name is Daniel. Probably he's from Europe town. <laughs> and a few other, a uh, few other bits. All right, guys. Uh, that was. Of course, Bali is on number one. You can say. Yeah, for for tourism, you know, Bali yeah. is uh, ultimate is the ultimate uh, choice for uh, tourism tourists. Most of the foreigners. But but Bali. there are also. Uh, you know, I, I should say thousands of places yeah. in uh, Jakarta. As we know, probably mm. 17,000, 17,000. More than 17,000, yeah. yeah. So that is why, you know, it is a tourist, uh, you know, heaven. So anyway, the, uh, the way he said that uh, it is business oriented most of the, mostly, but not mean that the uh, tourists, you know, foreigners cannot, uh, so don't have the places to visit. There must be some places, but he might he might have not visited those. But anyway, that was our reaction. If you guys like it, please make sure to give a like, subscribe, and that's a bell icon. And suggest us more videos in the comment section. So that's it for today. See you in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Have a nice day.